Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. For some repairs, or when moving the refrigerator through a tight space, you may need to remove one or both doors. Before you attempt this, be sure to unplug the appliance. When removing the freezer door, your first step is to pull the kick plate off to access the water dispenser tube. Use an open-ended wrench to press down on the quick connector to release the tube. Be prepared for some water to spill out. Now, when removing either the freezer door or the refrigerator door, your next step is to remove the screw securing the top hinge cover. Slide the cover off and disconnect the wire harness if applicable. Remove the bolts securing the top hinge to the cabinet. Partially open the door, then carefully lift it off the bottom hinge. When you're ready to remount the door, consider applying some silicone-based grease to the lower cam first. Now position the door. If you're replacing the freezer door, make sure the water dispenser tube is first inserted through the hole in the hinge pin. Then slide the door onto the pin and close it. Reposition the top hinge and secure it with the bolts. Make sure the door is level before tightening the bolts. Reconnect the wire harness if applicable. Slide the hinge cover back on and secure with the screw. If applicable, fully insert the water dispenser tube into the connector and snap the kick plate into place. You can now plug the appliance back in.